Hello, I'm Helen Bradley. Welcome to this video tutorial. In this video I'm going to show you how to create a print template for a triptych or three images side by side in Lightroom. I'm here in the print module in Lightroom and I'm ready to set up my triptych. Now the first thing I want to do is to select custom package because I want it to be a custom package and what I get is the default custom package. So I'm just going to start removing things because I don't want any of these on my triptych. And I'm going to page because I have an identity plate there and I don't want the identity plate in my picture. Now the first thing I'm going to do is set up my page. Now I want to do a print job and I want to send it to a JPEG image. So I'm just going to select JPEG file and I'm going to set up the custom file dimensions and I want this to be 11 inches wide and 8.5 inches tall. And I'm going to set it up, well, yes, that's all right for 300 ppi. So this is all ready to go. Now, if I wanted to send it to the printer, I would select printer in the print job and I would go over here to page setup and I would set up my paper this way. But I have mine set up here, or I did a minute ago. And here we are, it's all ready to go. So the next thing I need to do is to select the images that I want to use. So I'm going here into my collections and I have a set of images that I'm going to use and this is these Queenslander images. Now I have a print version but I want the Queenslanders, the regular version. And now that I have this custom package set up, all I need to do is to drag and drop an image into the layout. So I can drag it in and size it to suit. Now I'm going to need three images across, so I'm going to need to leave plenty of room to fit three of these across. I'm just going to make sure that this is a good size and then I'm going to image settings to see just what sort of image settings I have. Well I have a photo border and I don't want that and I have a very thin inner stroke and that's going to be a little bit thinner still than that. So when I turn guides off that's what I'm going to see and that's looking pretty good to me. So now that I have one image in place, I can just drag to create the other two the exact same size. So I'm going to click on this and alt drag to create the second one and alt drag to create the third. And I have snap to grid now turned on so I can just click so that these are all going to snap to the grid. And I'm just going to eyeball exactly where they should go and just make sure when I turn off guides that they're looking evenly spaced, which they are. So there's the basis of my triptych and I can just experiment with it now because all I need to do is to drag and drop a different image into each of these containers and then I have my triptych working. Just drag this one into here. But that's the basic of designing a triptych in Lightroom. But of course if we want to use this over and over again we're going to need to do something different with it. We're going to have to save it as a template. Now there's a couple of ways that we can do this. If we create it as a saved print then we're going to save it with these images in it and it's going to be in our collections. So for a start let's do that. We'll create a saved print and we're going to call this Windows. It's going to sit next to the collection it belongs to and I can include only the used photos if I want to and click create. So that's ready now to print any time I want to. But if I want to save this so I can use it with any collection any time in future then I need to save it as one of these templates. So I'm going to click the plus sign here and then create a template from it and I'm going to call it triptych. And it's going in user templates and I'm going to click create. Oh, I already have one. So let's call this triptych vertical. And then click create. And here it is in my user templates and it's called triptych vertical. And I can go back to it at any time and use it with any collection inside Lightroom. So let's go and get a different collection. Let's go to Pics of Rome. And here I have some 
pictures from Rome and I can just drag and drop any of those into this triptych and we can use it for those images as well. And we can use it for any set of images inside Lightroom. Of course, if we want to go back to the version that we've already created, we can do that as well. We're going down here to look for Windows. It's saved here as a print collection. I can click on this and here it is as a print template and here are the images that go in it and I can just reload the images and I'm ready to print it. So it's saved in two ways. The most valuable of those two ways really is as this user template as a triptych vertical because it can then be used for any set of images anytime in Lightroom.